If you like this video and channel, click on the like button and subscribe button. Also, if you want to have notification when new video released, click on the notified button. Welcome in the video where you can see how to use Knowhow protection on your function block, for example, in your PLC program. OK, we have some new project where we have organization block. In this organization block, we create to this organization block, we create some function block, for example, with name also main. OK, function block number one with name main. Now we click on the OK button. And for this part of code, for example, in network one, we create some new tags. We create two tags of data type bool. This will be input and one tag also of data type bool. This will be output, for example, with name output one and input text with name input one and two. We save the project and now we can use this text in our small program of the function block main. We use this text in network one of the function block one. Okay, now we create simple program in our function block. Now we can drag and drop this function block into our organization block. And now automatically TIA portal asks us if we want to create also single instance data block. We create data block number one with same name, main. OK. Now you can check is, if everything is OK. We op again open the function block. OK, program is into network one. Now if we want to protect this function block, we click on it, right click and click on the option Know How Protection. Now you can see the window Define Protection where you insert your new password for protecti protecting your function block and then again you configure the password it's the same like a new password password can be can be caps lock sensitive we use as password for example john word john where the first letter will be uppercase now you can see on the function block icon, you can see the small icon of lock. This means the block is Knoha protected. Now, when you click on the function block, you must insert the password. First, we insert that password and how you can see the enter password is invalid. Then we insert the right password, but not uppercase on the start. And that is also no good password. And now we insert the right password. Click on the OK. And now we can see all program and all networks in our function block. If you open the function block but you don't insert the password, you can see only local variables of the function block but not program. How you can see the block is read only because it's know how protected and the program code code part is clear but as you can see you can watch what is in the local variables in the local database insta instance database of the function block <coughs> now for example we create two static variables these local variables you can see in this table static also if you don't know the password but this is all what you can see 
only which variables, local variables, programmer used for this function block, but no other things like the program of the function block. As you can see, if you insert the right password, you can see everything, static values and also program in network 1. But if you don't insert the password, you can see only local variables of the function block. This is all for this video. Thank you for watching and goodbye.